also the kind of brain that you find in reptiles. Now, when I was a child, I would go to the science museum and look at the snakes sometimes, and they would stare back at me. And I would wonder, what are they thinking about? Well, I think now I know. What they're thinking about was, is this person lunch? Then we have the center part of the brain going forward, and that's the so-called monkey brain, the mammalian brain, the brain of emotions, the brain of social hierarchies. Amber Dosuba here Nalo gives you another example, a problem faced by a customer of a pizza by the slice stand. I'm hungry, and I don't have much time or money, but I'm tired of hamburger and want a change of pace. Also, I'd like to be able to specify the exact ingredients I want in my meal. And UT would be really swell to have a glass of wine or beer with the meal. Amber Dosuba Nalo says you should think about your customers for a minute. What is the problem that you solve for them? Nalo says you must write out your description of the problem your business solves for its customers. And that this statement will become part of your completed business plan. Remember earlier I told you about completed business plan before? Well, Nalo is saying your description of the problem your business solved for its customers will become part of your completed business plan. Okay, now have you write out your description of the problem your business solves for its customers? Have you thought about the problem that you solve for your customers? Then finally, the front of the brain is the human brain, especially the prefrontal cortex. This is where rational thinking is. And when you ask yourself a question, where am I anyway? The answer is right behind your forehead, 